Will Josh Dobbs be able to bounce back? Well, I hope so. I feel like last night's game against the Chicago Bears was kind of a rude awakening. Um, us learning the hard way not to drink too much of the purple Kool-Aid. We know it tastes good, but um, at one point, it'll get a little um, a little bitter. And last night, that Kool-Aid expired. Josh Dobbs. At one point, we we lost the turnover battle by four, so no bueno right there. And overall, the Bears' defense, they outplayed our offense, and our defense had to drag our offense along the whole way, which was crazy because it was the exact opposite last year in 2022. So a uh, big improvement by the defense. I have the, ul- the ultimate utmost respect for Brian Flores and for Kevin O'Connell. I just hope that his play calling, you know, Obviously, Kevin O'Connell can call a good game, and I really do want to see him call a good game since he has before. And I just feel like, you know, there were some plays where we were kind of running the ball, and we when it looked more of like a, a down where we could have passed the ball. But, you know, it is what it is. Uh, we'll bounce back, get to the next one. Josh Dobbs, if he plays, is assuming we don't replace him with Jaron Hall because I love Josh Dobbs, and the game, this is why this game was very disappointing. Um, especially for the guys who love Josh Dobbs. So um, I still believe in the past or not, and um, I, hope for, I hope to see improvements. So um, Josh Dobbs, hope he can bounce back.